Breaking Bad season 2 finale. I'm here for it. I watched the last two episodes this morning, but I'm just like, I can't wait. Because I'm not sure what we saw happening actually happened. Did he literally just stand by as Jane choked in front of him? I'm quite hopeful that maybe the episode starts and it turns out to be not true. That she just looks very bad, but that jesse's gonna wake up or that walter is gonna do something and not just stand there and leave but then again it's also breaking bad so mm, it's not like i don't anticipate anything bad happening <laughs> i feel like that's major too let's just get into it because i cannot wait and also think that even if jane passes away i don't think this will help the situation between jesse and walt whatsoever but who knows also have we heard their baby's name already did i miss that i feel like i constantly say our little girl but i feel like i've missed the name or have we spoken about it in previous episodes okay i'm right here let's get into this one if you like reactions like these make sure to like and subscribe and as always if you want to see the full reaction i post those on patreon please enjoy together with me let's go you always forget it and then it's back and you're like okay i forgot about that so creepy <laughs> i wonder did the show like sell stuffed animals like this afterwards like what could it be the thing is burned the car is crashed it also looks like it was wet and like soaked like fell into water or something or is it sand like the body bags are so like uh and it is her house i'm uh, holy what oh my god i have chills this is like is this foreshadowing for next seasons or are we gonna get the answer today it seems far away from where we are right now Go, 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 Listen to me. Oh my god, please say some sweet worst first. Everything is gonna be okay. okay. I promise. No, no, li listen, calm down. I know who to call. Soul. Who is this? <laughs> Saul Goodman sent me. Of course. <laughs> That's the door. Where is she? What's he gonna do? Drag out a body in the middle of the day? Also, like, her dad knows that she's there, so... Mm. I wonder what's gonna happen if Jesse ever finds out that he was there. Or is he gonna do a... She was already dead when I came in. <laughs> he needs to clean away all the drug references. Good luck, chap. Here's your story. You woke up. You found her. That's all you know. Say it. There's gonna be drugs in their system, no? Like, if you test it... <laughs> Say it. I woke up, I found her, that's all I know. I woke up, I found her, that's all I know. Again? I woke up, I found her, that's all I know. Poor Jesse, like... There's nothing here to incriminate you, so I'd be amazed if you got placed under arrest. If you do, you tell them you just want your lawyer, and you call Saul Goodman. Surprise, he just drives up in his car, gets out and gets in again in the middle of the day. You put on a long sleeve shirt and cover those track marks on your arm. Count down from 20, and then you dial. Is there no drugs anywhere else? Like, it seems so... What if, like, another bag's dropped out of the kitchen sink? <laughs> Junior! It's Flynn. Flynn! I'll be there in a minute! <laughs> it's a teenager. Let him do. Like, if it makes him happy... Are those donations? <laughs> yes. <laughs> For four hundred and ninety dollars. Oh, that's so nice. It, it, it's all real actual money. I'm also so happy for him. Hang in there, Walt. Good luck. H hang in there. It, isn't this awesome? Oh god, it's so sweet for him. Wow. Imagine if there wasn't There's this disgusting something. background story. How wholesome this must be. Like a little thank you is in order. Yes, absolutely. 
Thank you, son. Oh my god, it's so sweet. Uh, 20, 20 more bucks from Thunder Bay on Ontario. How many did they actually want to put in? Now, how did I know you wouldn't be answering your phone? Oh god. I'm on my way. I'm going to be there momentarily. I expect you on the porch, bag packed, ready to go. No excuses. I think it's very powerful that they put the drug deal side next to scenes where you see the consequences of drug use with their family before with jane because it keeps you grounded in terms of like what they're doing is so bad for people and we don't see that we just see their quest but showing this oh, oh my god imagine see your kid like that oh my god is why is he why did you not leave him out? You may not want to be here for this. Oh my god, be more aware of his presence. What? Just imagine, just imagine being him for a second. This is so bad. Oh my god, like I cannot fathom how he's still in that house. Looking at the body bag. She's actually dead. I cannot believe it. All right, some of you already know my brother-in-law. He's a good man. The doctor's saying this operation has a real oh, chance of helping. Him. Nice transition. Christian Ortega. That's so sweet. Hank is such a good Shot guy. I cannot Superman. believe it. Combo, I hear you say? Now, how is it that the purest, most professional grade of meth we've ever come across is being slung by the likes of that? Because it's a new guy. The blue stuff's banished from town. Not a speck to be found in Albuquerque. Now, why is that? It's maybe your Heisenbergs in prison. Or he's Heisenberg. We've got reports of the blue stuff making the scene here in Texas, Arizona, Colorado, Nevada. Everywhere but here. <laughs> so he must be there. Somebody wised up, stop shitting where they eat. I say he's going regional. Oh, he's still right here in town. How are you going to find him, though, if they selling everywhere but here? <gasps> four, four, four dollars, <laughs> 2018, <laughs> yes! Oh my god, if it wasn't for this background, this was the beautiful story. This is like a GoFundMe. APD's been known to sit on this place, keep an eye on the comings and goings. You could just get mugged or shot. Let me handle this. I'm a bit scared because this episode is starting out way too calm. Like, it is a season finale. So, I, like, I expect something really bad to happen. Is this gonna be it? Well, what is he doing? Oh, he's actually right there. I was kind of hoping he wouldn't. Let's get out of here. I'm so surprised. Last episode too, like how much Walt cares for Jesse. <laughs> it's crazy how Walt life is finally falling into place and Jesse's one is completely breaking down. I killed her. Oh no. Look at me. You didn't kill anybody. Oh, no, oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, like scenes like that are so strong. With him, it's like he's fighting this for so long. Okay, yes. yes. He's just listening to the sound of <laughs> cashier thing all day long. Turn down the volume. That it, it's money. Just yeah, he's so right. Like, come on. You were going to be in the newspaper. N no way. One of Aunt Marie's patients works at the journal, and when she told him about the website and all the donations, he went to his editor, and they're going to do a story about you. Oh. It'll, it'll mean more hits. And more contributions. That's true, though. Like, right? <laughs> hey, it's a pleasure. Good to meet you. Uh -huh. And Gustavo Fring of <gasps> Los Pollos Hermanos. Please, just Gus. Hi, Gus. Gotta tell you, you guys make some killer chicken. <laughs> yeah, the group nice. that uh, I supervise focuses on methamphetamine, which uh, is a growing problem in the country, unfortunately. Terrible. Yeah, terrible. <laughs> it's my brother-in-law. Yeah, he's got a health issue. We're we're trying to. Oh, I'm I'm very sorry. What what sort of health issue? Lung cancer. Oh, that's a rough one. Oh, hey, 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 you don't you don't have to do that. Please, please, I, I'm I'm happy to do it. I'm surprised how much money is already in there. I, I won't be back for a while. Gonna have my surgery on Friday. It looks so cozy there, in fact. Saul will take care of things. He's got your money. He's keeping it for you. Mm, don't know how to feel about that. Lingering on things doesn't help. Believe me, just try and focus Literally on getting better. Literally just happened while let him be for a while. 
I deserve this. What you said in the desert, I get it. No. What you meant. No, 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 no. I deserve whatever happens. It's not true. Although he done some bad stuff. It's so hard this show. Like, if you step back, you're like, you guys need to go to jail for a long time, both of you. And then you see them like face to face and you're like, no, it's fine. It, just, <laughs> it messes with your mind. This is him? Yes. This is dad. Great. Uh, let's get everyone over here on the couch. <laughs> oh, his face. We don't even know what to say. It's just, it's, it's been incredible. Walter, at least smile a little. He's the best. You don't want to lose him, do you, Walter? <laughs> Where he's like, smile, motherfucker. He's a good man, isn't he? A absolutely. A ask anyone. <laughs> smile is like, he's a great father, a great teacher. He knows like everything there is to know about chemistry. He's patient with you. And he's always there for you. Man, that must be so rough to hear because he's not been one of those things for a long time. He, he always does the right thing. And that's how he teaches me to be. Don't snap. Oh, the amount of things that he's dealing with at once. I'm surprised he doesn't explode. I don't know what this stuff is, but... Oh, no. It's pretty great. <laughs> oh, no. What if he starts saying bad stuff or gets addicted to stuff like this? Because he's like, oh, this feels great. Your cell phone, did you bring it? Which one? Oh, my God. I'm, I'm pretty sure he didn't, he didn't bring it, Mom. Oh, my God. I think I just died a little. Oh, and you expect him to say something really, really bad. And even with two simple words, it's like, bam, trust is gone, man. She's um seven weeks tomorrow. Se seven, right? Yeah. Look at that freaking pink sweater on him. Oh, she's beautiful. Nice. Always a relief to say that and actually mean it. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Shortness of breath? A bit, but much better. Also, like, a lot going on. You bought yourself some real time here. There's no reason not to be optimistic. That is great. Thank you, doctor. She's looking a little bit distraught. Make sure you avoid any heavy lifting and continue to get plenty of rest. Um, but he can be on his own. I mean, just more, you know, independent. Okay, what, what's this line of questioning? <laughs> One less baby in the house. <laughs> uh, oh, attention. Dad, hey, hey, Stu. Wait, why are we seeing him now? It's good to be back. Pima 311, contact Albuquerque Center 134.6. It seems like a job where you need to have some focus. I think I may just keep this. Doesn't look so bad, right? Is she gonna leave him? Is that why she asked? I'm going to Hank and Marie's for the weekend. <gasps> oh my God! Since when? I'm taking the baby with me. She was just waiting for him to get better enough. I want you to pack your things and leave. Skylar. I want you gone by Monday morning. I want, <gasps> I want you gone. My God, like, oh, wow. Right before your surgery, I asked if you had packed your cell phone and you said, which one? Skylar, I was medicated. Did she find it? I'm having an affair. Is that what you think? That's what I was thinking. Well, my guess was Gretchen Schwartz. Something was going on between you. Mm. I am not having an affair with Gretchen. Oh, I know. I know you're not, because I asked her. <gasps> oh my god! Gretchen and Elliot didn't give you a dime. They paid for nothing. Oh god. But that didn't make sense because I checked with Del Cavoli in the hospital and, and we're nearly paid up over $100,000 out of thin air. But then I called your mother. And he didn't go. Maybe she contributed? It's possible. Oh my God, like his life is shattering in front of his eyes. It, it turns out that not only is the money not from your mother, she didn't even know that you have cancer. Lies on top of lies. Oh my God, I'm like, what's, what, no, what, no, what, no, what? If I tell you the truth, will you stay? I would say it kind of depends on the truth though. Stay and I also and don't I even know if you everything. want it that moment when, like it's too late. Ooh, I did not expect that because I would want to know, like, what the f went on. But I think, how freaking strong is she to stay with him knowing all of this until the doctors cleared him to be fine on his own? Cleared direct to Albuquerque via the aircraft calling, please stand by. 
Jane, Mike, two one, turn heading. Jane. Lifeguard four six, clear direct Albuquerque, climb and maintain one seven thousand. He calls it Jane instead of Julian. Contact Albuquerque Center one three four point six. Wayfair five one five. Defender. My God, he's not gonna get a crash going right. Oh God. Is that the plane crashed and that's everything they found? And that's the helicopter is the fire. Holy shit. No way. Oh my god, duck, everybody! I think I'd be running inside. He's just like. Holy shit! Oh my god, no way! Damn, like. Whoa! This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Because, first of all, the story was super calm. Like, no murders and blood shootings and all of that but the whole story with Skyler is completely crumbled down and I don't know what they're gonna do I don't know if he's gonna tell her and she's gonna believe it and also if she would would you stay I also don't know if I would want to stay with someone who does all these things the lying but also putting other people in danger in the criminal aspect like drilling drugs is so wrong <laughs> And then like all the other crimes that were connected to it violent stuff it's very interesting to see how they make a connection through jesse towards jane and then jane towards her dad and then dad towards plane crash i was surprised that he was back at work because i i do think i've heard somewhere that people who do these plane direction things that that's one of the highest focus job ever and i've heard but i could be completely wrong that they can only do it like for a specific amount of time because it needs so much focus and it's so dangerous if they mess up and here we go uh wow okay <laughs> it's so like i wonder how they're gonna start season three i was always thinking like there's not really a setup towards that and now it's like okay i want to see the next episode right now i think it won't be long before i record the next ones because wow i'm so interested in the skylar wall dynamic i'm in her team i'm sorry to say it but i would also leave I would want to know what happened though, but I think I would still want to leave. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this reaction. I hope you're gonna join me into season three. If you did like this one, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, if you want to see the full reaction, I post those on Patreon for you to enjoy together with me. I'll see you in season three. I wish you a lovely rest of your day. Bye bye.